And we're back with hares. Yep. I couldn't remember if they were rabbits or hares. We're starting off with the rocky fur, who is a golem subtype. Because they're going in yep. order by the same thing as the major sub... Okay, you know what I'm talking about. At first glance, it may look scary, but it's actually gentle and loving when its yellow eyes glow staringly through its wild animal instincts have awakened. Strangely. Wait, when it's yellow... Never mind, I'm not going to stick with that one. When its yellow eyes glow strangely, not staringly. Oh. Can I not read? Hold on. Oh, why did I read staringly? That one sh Okay, when its yellow eyes go straight... <laughs> oh my goodness. They're staring at me. Yep. They're staring He's at you strangely. <laughs> he has a funny run. I don't know. I mean, he's part golem. I like it. I kind of like his feet, actually. How they did the claws. They're like kind of rounded, like stones. Kind of does almost like a kick or something as he steps forward. <laughs> Looks like some old man going down the street. Alrighty. The pole scorn. A nice little monster, cool looking, kind of shy. Clad in fashionable sky blue and pearl white, it's a big hit with the end crowd. Or so the scholars say. So when would a scholar know what the end crowd is? Maybe they're a style expert. Didn't we have a pulse score back in the first game? Did we? He looks I remember him looking cooler than this, but this guy, this guy still looks okay. I like the claws on his fur there. Yeah, I'm not feeling it. Yeah, I remember the first one looking cooler. The hair. A popular monster with the ladies. Ooh, the ladies. Despite its cute face, it can deliver a powerful punch. The Monster Association cautions against overfeeding, though. Okay. Again, I like how they did the hair overall in Monster Rancher 4. His face, though, looks like it's too kind of dopey. Yeah, I, I guess the overall design I like is how they made his hands more like a boxer. Mm -hmm. He doesn't look as fat as he did in the first Monster Rancher. But yeah, his face... I think they could have made his face slightly more serious. Yeah, because hair in the original series, like in the anime series, was also a really cool character. Yeah. I liked his... He always wanted to punch people, didn't he? Yeah, well, I think he... Like, he liked fighting. That's where they, they met him. They found him, him like, in a tournament. Yeah, they found, found him in a tournament. He was boxing, basically, so... Yeah. The fairy hair. It prefers watching and cheering others onto fighting itself. But when it gets mad, it puts on a grim expression and lets loose some mighty punches. Yeah, not one of the best hairs out there, but... No. Oh, they put the heart on the back. I like that. Yeah, not a bad design. I'm glad they didn't put a thong on this one, because I'm pretty sure one of the previous ones had one. They did. I can't remember which Monster Rancher it was. The Ugh. gun bit. No. With its highly calculating mind, it plans ahead instead of leaving battles up to brute strength. Consider it, it tries not to use too much of its breeder's money. I didn't know they could spend money. No, I do not like the gun bit. I just... I don't think Durahan. I think World War II bomber. <laughs> Poor Durahan. I just... I don't see a Durahan. He looks too mecha. Like, Durahans are supposed to be, like, armor. Like, medieval armor. This looks way too mech. Uh, I, I do agree. I mean, it could have been done a little bit better, I think. Yeah. I think they could have put, like, a whole... Like, a helmet with a visor on him, and I think he would have looked more appropriate. <laughs> the rubber rabby? <laughs> also sometimes called blood hair because of its blood I'm sorry, I had an extra word there because of its red nose. Despite its looks it can be unbelievably violent and can even make even veteran bra breeders quake. Man, I had been doing so well and I finally botched one up really bad. Well, at least they didn't put a face on its ears or something. Oh god, that would have been creepy. Yeah, I I don't dislike the design, but... <laughs> <laughs> the Jacaranta? With its pumpkin head, it doesn't need an umbrella. It loves the rain. It gets lonely, so it likes groups, and it really, and it gets really attracted to its breeder. Attached, really attached. Attached. Oh my gosh! <laughs> Helper even jumped in and said, "Oh my gosh, no!" It says attached. <laughs> I like how they had a cut up for the tail in the I back. I like there. the design on this one. 
Yeah, I, I really like this one. I mean, I wouldn't pick this one, but as far as if I had to actually design something that was sub poncho, I, I like it. It does say attached. I'm like Freudian slipping this whole thing, aren't I? Yeah. I can't read. <laughs> oh. The Tobita. A passionate, chivalrous guy that always feels bad if he hurts his opponents. Highly responsible, this leader type can also sometimes get himself into trouble. Love yep. the eyebrows. It looks part rate. Oh, I love the little wings. And the feet. They did a good job on this one. Yeah, they did. The Angua hair. It, it looks like it's always just spacing out, but actually nothing could be further from the truth. Oh, so it's Helper. It can be reckless at times, but it has a heart full of hope. Oh, so it's like Helper. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's the same thing pretty much they did with the tiger. Yeah, they gave it like a Simple backpack but of effective. armor. Yeah. It's gonna bother me what that thing is called. I'm almost tempted to skip ahead because I still can't remember. We had one! Oh, spy hair. <laughs> Nobody has ever been able to figure out much about it. It's, uh, it's usually looking around like it's nervous. Maybe it's backed by some kind of shady organization. Oh my gosh, this is so exciting. Did this, is this one that came off the Spice Girl CD? <laughs> I have no idea. <laughs> one of them did, and I didn't have that CD. If you wanted my sister. My sister left me her uh, music binder on accident full of 90s music and and stuff like that. If you're wondering why I have Spice Girl CDs at all. I kind of I was, like I have guy. to admit. Oop, okay. That was it, really? Yep. There's only one special hair? That's it. Oh, alright. Bye, guys. Bye, guys.